Hey guys, thanks for joining me today. I'm going to go over a sequence from the 2021 Gold Cup Final. Uh, one, it was a great sequence and kind of showing how quickly fortunes can change during the run of play. Two, there's a couple great recovery runs. And then lastly, there's a great run done by a forward here. It's just a really crafty run. He does a great job of roaming around the defense. We're going to pick it up right after the right at the end of the first half, right after a corner kick. And U.S has cleared the ball out and is looking to go on the counter. Now, this run here is a great run. He, the U.S. attacker here, does a great job of kind of being physical enough and holding off this defender that's trying to hang on to him and kind of spin him around. Now, what needs to be done on this attack is the space behind the defense here needs to be found and the ball needs to be played into it for the attack to continue developing instead he takes a few extra touches and here's recovery tackle number one by the mexican defender just a great job of knifing back in there and then immediately pushing the ball back up the field now because the counter was so quick off the corner kick u.s kind of has numbers back so they're not caught too far forward um there's a forward on on the other side of the field that's in the offside position he's not threatening in any way and what you'll see is this attack will kind of stall out for the time being and will be played back. Now, right here is the start of that kind of crafty run I was alluding to earlier by the attacker. And he, again, just does a really good job of roaming in these soft spots in the defense. And there's plenty of defenders to pick him up, but he still just kind of moves around and finds these soft spots. Just watch him as he kind of Okay, he's going over this way, staying in front. The ball gets played out, so he immediately changes back, opens that space back up, and now he should be picked up at this point, but he's not. Instead, he's allowed to kind of just move right into this space. And there's a great flick on the sideline here over the defender to play the ball down the wing. Um, but then right now, he's just open. I mean, if he can get a pass through to him, he's going to have a great goal scoring opportunity but instead there's another great recovery run here another couple kind of sloppy touches and um, the ball kind of gets jumbled about and then ends up in a foul and the play stops but again I just wanted to go over it because these are the kind of sequences that lead to plenty of goals and just because it didn't hear uh, doesn't mean it's not significant there's plenty to learn from this sequence both good and bad and I hope you guys enjoyed watching. If you enjoyed this or have another sequence that you'd like to see broken down similarly, let me know. Either drop a comment or hit me up on Twitter at Joe Knows.